guys back here with another quick video this time I'm just gonna show you the MBD 18 battery pack or the uh, battery grip I guess for the D850 and here's some of the options so with it it comes with the battery grip itself and it's got a couple of attachments it's got the four AA carrier that just pops out in the side here And you can attach that right to the bottom of the camera. This will give you like the least amount of power or runtime. And then you have the other included battery carrier. And this is for your the Nikon ENEL 15A or whatever. It just pops right in. So it only holds one. I thought it'd be able to hold two, but I guess not. And that just pops in here. And that goes flush. And the third option, so these two options comes with the Nikon MB D18. So it comes with the AA carrier and the standard battery holder here. And in these two configurations, it doesn't increase the frame rate, it'll just increase the runtime. If you want to increase the frame rate, you'd have to get the additional accessories. So you got to get the ENEL18B battery. It's pretty chunky. Look at that sucker compared to the smaller built-in battery or for the body itself. That kind of gives you an idea of how big it is, but it's, it's got a lot of power. So you want the ENEL18B and the BL5 battery cap. So you have to buy the special cap so that you can attach the battery like so. And it snaps, snaps right in there. Pull the green out. $25 option. Come on, Nikon. So it pops right in. And then it just pops right into the bottom of the battery pack. And then let's attach it to the bottom of the D850 here. Alright, so it looks like I gotta remove this rubber cap here. So don't lose this. And just line things up. It's like a long tripod screw. There you have it. So now <laughs> your camera becomes much chunkier. But I do like it. It's worth it for a couple of reasons. This battery pack in, back in particular, <laughs> can't talk. The This battery grip in particular, the MBD18 for DA50, not only does it extend the runtime of your camera, it also gives you, I don't know, of course, the vertical grip. So if you want to, it's good for portraiture. And then you've got the function dials. Increases the battery life, so if you're going to do time-lapse photography, that's really helpful for that. So it gives you extra time in addition to this one here, the built-in one. But the big thing is the ability to shoot 9 frames per second. So let's see if I can get it to do that here. I don't know if the battery's charged. I just took it out of the... just took it right out of the... Um, Box. I'm going to go to continuous high, put that manual. That sound like 9 frames per second? It must be, so that's pretty cool. So let's just test that without the battery grip, let's see how fast or you can tell. Okay, so the battery grip is off, and this should be 7 frames per second. Yeah, actually there is a difference. So that's not bad. But yeah, you sure pay for that privilege though, guys. My god. So to get this battery grip, the battery, the ENEL 18B battery, this is about, a, I got this about 150 bucks. 25 bucks. This is, I think, just shy of 350. And then the charger, which it didn't come in the mail yet. That's on back order.
for fun, I have the Nikon D850 with the battery grip, the MBD18, that gives me the 9 frames per second. And then we have the standard Nikon D500. I also have the battery grip on here too, just, just for show. But actually it doesn't increase the frame rate. So here is the D850 at 9 frames per second, I'm assuming. And here is the D500 at 10 frames per second. I can't really tell the difference actually. 10 frames per second, 9 frames per second. So really, really close. So that's just a quick demo there. But yeah, I'm not sure. I couldn't really tell the difference, to be honest. But they both, yeah, I both have the uh, battery grip on here. And you know, like I said, the battery grip on the D500 is just cosmetic. It doesn't really do anything. Well, it does. It gives you ex extended battery life. So if you're doing time lapse, whereas the Nikon D850 actually does something. And that is because of the $700 option. Come on, Nikon. This big, ba big fat battery here. And the, the uh, battery uh, cap. So there you have it, guys. D850, D500. 9 frames per second, 10 frames per second. Not a big difference that I can tell, but I'm sure it is. All right, guys. Later.